The Calusa Nature Center and Planetarium says a girl went to the hospital for mercury exposure after she broke a light bulb in the planetarium's projector. I'm Fox 4's Austin Shugarotsky. I came here as soon as I found out, and I've been watching as these teams behind me have been decontaminating this area for mercury. Eric Raditz, the planetarium's director, said the planetarium is being renovated, so they upgraded to a new projector and are donating the old one to a college. The team came out today uh, to dismantle it, and one of the employees, uh, I guess, hit a light bulb uh, from the college and the light bulb burst, uh, leaving her exposed to some mercury. It's a very small amount from what I'm told. Fort Myers Fire Department's division chief, Todd Poland, said the girl and two other college employees drove themselves to the hospital after it happened. He said they're currently being decontaminated and evaluated. Poland said only a small amount of mercury escaped, so they're doing cleanup using mercury detectors to make sure it all gets removed properly. We took it very seriously. Safety is our biggest concern, uh, a top priority for everyone who comes to the Calusa Nature Center and Planetarium. But as we renovate and look forward to uh, creating a brand new planetary environment, uh, this is part of the process of uh, shaping it into something bigger in the community. And we are very glad to always have a safe space. Raditz says he expects the planetarium will be cleaned by the end of the day, but it will remain temporarily closed for renovations. However, the Nature Center will be open as normal. Reporting in Fort Myers, I'm Austin Chagorotsky, Fox 4 News.